In the last couple months, AT&T released their own trial, finally, alongside T-Mobile. So AT&T is offering 30 days. Uh, they give you 100 gigs of data, 25 gigs of hotspot data, and unlimited calling and texting. So in today's video, I'll be covering how to download the AT&T trial onto your phone. The only requirements are that you have to be in the United States, your device has to be unlocked, and it has to be an iPhone XR or newer. You can't download it on Android quite yet. That's not coming until early 2025. So the first thing you'll want to do is head over to the App Store. Go to search, type in my at and It should be the first or second result. You're just gonna wanna download that app right there. Once you have it downloaded, go ahead and open it. The first thing it'll ask you is if you want notifications. Personally, I'm gonna say no. So just hit continue, don't allow or allow. And then you'll be greeted with the welcome screen of the app. So you'll see that right here it says try at and wireless for free. You wanna tap on that. Then it'll give you the greeting screen for the 30 day trial, 100 gigs of data, 25 gigs of hotspot, and unlimited calls and texts. So hit the start your trial button at the bottom. Hit check at eligibility, enable location services, allow while using app. This just verifies that you're in the United States. Now that we've done that, we can set up a profile. So you'll just need basic information, address, name, current number, and email address. If you don't have a current number and you're trying to do this trial just to have service in general, I recommend trying a TextNow app or some sort of free texting app that will give you a phone number. After you set up your profile, just hit continue, and then it'll start to bring you through the eSIM setup. So hit next, 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 and activate. I'm gonna walk you through all of this. If it asks you to activate the new eSIM, just hit allow. Then it will bring up the eSIM trial screen. So go ahead and hit continue. Be prepared to give it a few minutes. Sometimes it takes a while to activate. You'll start to see that in your control center area, you'll see that second line added. So for me, I already have Cricket activated on here and now the second line comes up as AT&T. So it'll go, it'll go and give you a phone number, just hit done. And then it'll ask you about cellular plan labels. Now, if this is the only eSIM you have on your phone, then you'll just want to stick to primary for everything. But in my case, since I already have another eSIM on my phone, I'm going to leave my main contact as, or my main SIM as primary, and I'll just keep the second one business. Go ahead and hit continue. For me, I don't want to use the AT&T number because since I have my actual line on here, so I'm just going to hit primary and continue. For iMessage and FaceTime, I'm going to continue using my regular number, so primary and continue. Now, for cellular data, it'll give you a couple options here. So you could use your primary, which in my case is my current SIM card, or the business, which is the AT&T trial. There's also a feature called allow cellular data switching. So if your current provider loses service somewhere, but AT&T has service, it can switch off to that. So in my case, I'm just gonna select primary and continue. Then it'll bring you back to the app. It'll show you your free trial number. You can hit go to trial dashboard. And then this is where you'll be able to see how much data you've used, how much hotspot data you've used, and how many days you have left. That's all you have to do. Now you're all set up to use AT&T for 30 days and you'll get that nice 100 gig data allowance. If you enjoyed this video, please remember to subscribe, like, and comment to see more videos like this. I have an eSIM video playlist also linked in the video description below where I have other trials like T-Mobile, Mint Mobile, Visible by Verizon. I've made tutorials on all of those, so feel free to use any of those after your AT&T trial expires. That's all for today. See you in the next one. Peace.